Hey guys, it's Holly from Baby Gizmo. First, I want to apologize for my hair. We are at the beach. We are at Panama City Beach, and anytime I get near the ocean or the Gulf of Mexico, my hair gets crazy, like crazy big. So I had to put it up in a bun, so that's why it kind of looks, you know, kind of crazy today. But I wanted to do this video because I had this great idea, and I wanted to talk to you about it. I want to talk about repurposing baby gear. Now, this isn't new, but maybe you're not doing it. Now, when you have a baby and you get all of that stuff, think of all the stuff that goes with babies. You know, you use it when they're little, but as the baby grows, you might not use a few of the items because they just don't pertain to the baby anymore. So you either throw them away or give them away or they just stack up in a closet somewhere. So I want to talk today about turning them into something different that you can keep using for a longer period of time. And it could be as simple as a wipes case. Now, as I was getting ready to come to Panama City with my daughter, my other kids didn't come, so I wanted to bring my, my diaper bag because, you know, it fits a lot of things. But, as you know, the diaper bags, they come with wipes cases and the, um, the pads, the changing pads. Well, I didn't need a wipes case with an eight-year-old. I thought, gosh, I'm not bringing wipes. So I went to take it out, and then I started thinking. I could use this for something else. Instead of just throwing it away or putting it in the closet, you know what I did? I turned it into a pencil case. Now, I kind of think it's pretty cool. I'm not going to pat myself on the back, but I do think it's kind of cool. It perfectly fits pencils, pens, crayons. I could put scissors in here, and it snaps closed securely. It doesn't open. It's not going to fall open with everything falling out. I don't have to worry about boxes of crayons and pencils all over when, in our luggage. It's flat, and that is the best thing about it. So this size, it's not going to bulk up her bag. I can easily slide it into her bag without taking up a lot of room. It's sturdy. I think it's great. You turn your wife's case into a pencil and crayon case for on the go. Or they could even take it to school. And the, the wife's cases don't have a lot of craziness on it. This one just literally says Petunia Pickle Bottom. It's kind of chic, I guess. So that's one way, just one idea. And you know what? I know you guys have like a bazillion ideas. I know somebody's taking a crib sheet and making it into like t-shirts or something. I don't know. But what I want to do is I want to hear from you. I want to hear how do you take baby gear and turn it into something that you can use longer. I I'm dying to know. And so I really want you to email us. Email us at contact at babygizmo.com. And I'm going to turn this into a fun little thing that we're going to have going. Email us if we pick your idea and we turn it into a video and we share it with our audience. You know what? We're going to send you a gift. Um, it could be something as awesome as a pair of PD Pet shoes for your child. I'm going to try to cater the prizes to your specific children um, so that you get something that you can actually use and you don't have to repurpose. Um, so there you go. That's, like I said, just email us, contact at babygizmo.com, your idea. And of course, you know, we might get a couple of the same ideas. It's bound to happen. And we're going to go with the first one we get to award the prize. So if you see one of the videos, you're like, hey, it's mine. Um, just know I probably got the same one. Um, so definitely, you know, we're going to do this for a while. So if you see this video a couple weeks from now, just keep sending in your ideas because I think this is really cool. And I think moms need to know it and dads need to know it. So there you go. Email us. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You just have to hit the subscribe button right there. It's important to us because you know what? We love our subscribers and you don't want to miss a thing, right? So subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to like us on Facebook. Another thing that is really important to us because we're always on Facebook and we know you're on Facebook, at least most of you. And you know what? We want to chat with you. We want to get to know you. So, you know, like us on Facebook and that's it for me today. I'm Holly Schultz and I will talk to you next time. Bye.